Here we go. I think we, I feel like we kick every single one of our videos off literally at the gas pump. And that's where we at right now. Cause we always on the road. Damn, I forgot the, oh, so look, y'all notice anything different? Y'all probably notice something different right now. We got a brand new truck, all right? So this brand new whip, I haven't really figured out how to use it yet. So I'm here, I'm trying to pump gas and my gas cap ain't open. On the other truck, you just pull the gas cap open. Now I gotta put this down, come over here, hit that, pops open. Hey right, man, high tech, man. That's what happened when you, when you get a, we didn't moved up, y'all. We, we got a platinum edition, Tundra. You gotta open the you gotta open the gas tank from the inside get all fancy make sure it's you know unlocked and blah 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 so you don't get your gas siphon but uh big week this week man we are uh headed back to michigan last tournament of the year got a brand new truck going to a brand new lake that i've never been to it's like uh, saginaw bay lake huron one of the great lakes and i'm excited bro we got uh large mouth small mouth both gonna play this week but we got big decisions to make. We don't know what we're gonna fish for. And we got a lot, when I say we got a lot riding on this tournament, we got everything riding on this tournament, man. This is the make or break event right here. If we're gonna make the championship or not. So it's a, it's a big week. A lot, a lot, a lot on the line. A little bit of stress, I ain't gonna lie. But at the end of the day, it's fishing. And that's what we do, we fish. So, uh, you know, and plus we bounce it back off of a top 10 finish at St. Clair. That was awesome, smallmouth. One of my favorite things to catch and do, and I'm hoping this week is gonna be similar. We definitely gonna spend some time looking for them small jaws, but weather is gonna be the key factor this week because Saginaw Bay on Lake Huron can get, it can get flat out insane, dangerous, deathly. And so uh, you gonna have to play it, man. You got to figure it out. What's the wind doing? You gonna fish large mouth, small mouth? What we gonna do? I don't know, but y'all gonna see it. Stay tuned. I'm gonna pump this gas. I'm gonna go use a nice, Lo hey, shout out Loves. I'm here at Loves. Loves, if you're on the road traveling, no matter where in the country, Loves has the cleanest bathrooms, in my opinion. Probably. Besides Bucky's. Besides Bucky's. Bucky's is nice too. And they, Bucky's they are everywhere. And they're not everywhere. And they're kind of new. So uh, naturally, they're going to be nice. But Loves, you can, you can pull up in a Loves that's 20 years old, and low key, their bathroom is going to be clean, bro. They, they take care of their bathroom. So shout out Loves. I appreciate that. So I'm going to go here and take a tinkle. We're going to pump some gas. I'm gonna buy some fruit too. And that's enough, bro, love, they got fruit and love. It's the only gas station with fruit, bro. Pull it on my heartstrings, man. Hit, hit him up for next year. Hey, yeah, hey, loves. Hey, I'm, I'm available. <laughs> I'm available, I'm just saying. You know what I'm saying? So we, we didn't have a nice little chunk of time off, man. Uh, about a, eh, about a month, about a month. <clears throat> but man, as y'all know, y'all watch us on social media, you know, Instagram, Facebook, and all. It's, it's, it's off season or it's a break, but we always doing stuff, man. So we've had, since the, since the break, we've had iCast, which is, which is dope because you see all the new products that come out in the fishing industry. A lot of cool stuff that we'll utilize next year. Um, my boy J-Dub had a huge Saw plastic release with Rapala, that was dope. Uh, you know, and there was all kinds of cool products that come out. So that took place, had I cast. Man, I, I just came back from California. I went home and saw my mom for about a week. I hadn't seen my mom since Thanksgiving. Can y'all believe that? That is the hardest part about living in Alabama, man, is not just my mom, all my other, you know, I got aunts and uncles and cousins and you name it out in Cali that I just, I never, I never have an opportunity to see him because I live in Alabama and I'm always on the road. So taking a little time out to go see some family, that was dope. Got to hit the Delta for a couple days, which is my, hey, number one fishery in the world. I don't care what nobody say, <laughs> in my opinion. And it's going through a slump right now. But what we know about slumps, hey, we know a lot about them. Eventually you climb about that thing. And so right now the California Delta is having a little tough time. Lots of fish, a lot of small ones, but uh, the bigs are hard to find right now, but uh, she'll be back. Trust me, she will be back because the genetics are there. So it's just a matter of time. But uh, <clears throat> yeah, we've been working hard, man, on the off season. Well, not the off season, during the break, but now it's time to get back when on track. Fish with the veteran, <clears throat> y'all did that. Oh yeah, damn, let me not forget that. Yeah, we had a, a veteran's deal where we, me, myself, me, myself, <laughs> myself, 
Dusty Connell, uh, Greg Vincent, and Josh Butler, man. We kind of the local anglers in our in our zone, and we had an opportunity to take out some veterans, which was a really cool opportunity. I had a guy, man. His name was Chris. He was super cool, man, and uh, he's been through a lot to say the least, man. He's telling me some of his encounters overseas and in Iraq and Afghanistan, man, and whew, scary stuff, bro. But uh, to be able to take him out and ease his mind for a few hours and let him do something that he enjoys and, uh, you know, it's the least we could do, right, to give back to our veterans. It's not a big deal for me just to go fishing for a couple hours, but for him, I could tell it was very meaningful. He told me it's the most fish he'd ever caught, man, and um, you should see the excitement on that dude's face when he was hooked up. And uh, just to imagine the stuff that they go through, man, so we can so we can fish for a living and do everything that we get to do in this in this country, man. Um, yeah, man, we don't we don't take that for granted, and it's and it's different. It hits different when you actually sit down with somebody that's boots on the ground, and they're telling their story of live encounters. And I won't go into detail with what this particular guy's been through, but let me tell you, I don't know that I could have went through it, and uh, and he did it multiple times. And so, shout out to all the all the veterans out there man so that was that was another cool thing all this took place in the last month man we got a lot done and i had some time to chill which is important man you got to chill spend time with the wife the kids my daughter's big into dance these days she growing up man she's in high school about to be a junior no excuse me a sophomore and uh it's blowing my mind dude my son's a sophomore in college and i'm just out here getting old as hell trying to catch these bass <laughs> hey this is what we do Few more hours left. That's what. Hey, yeah, we 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 got some driving. So it's like 15, 16 hours from the house. It's all saggy, and according to my according to my GPS, we got nine hours and 42 minutes left. That's hella far. I hope that ain't right. That should be an hour off. Shouldn't it, Colin? Uh, ain't no way. Ain't yeah. no way. We got nine hours left. Well, ten, damn near really, ten really, hours. Really, really ten hours and 42 minutes. Nah, bro. We lose an hour. I know it, so I'm thinking that's just an hour of driving, but in real time, that can't be right, bro. I ain't buying that, bro. We've been on the road for four hours, five hours. Ain't no way. <laughs> I ain't buying that, bro. Somebody come drop this truck. Hey, yeah, man. Hey, can we teleport <laughs> to Bay City, man? Get a button. Boop. Who got the PJ? Hey, exactly, <laughs> boy. Hey, boy, come pick us up, bro. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I'm over here. I'm in, I'm in my Tennessee, South Tennessee, bro. Come grab me. Fly, somebody come fly your boy. <laughs> Three miles still empty. <laughs> so you know we got the new whip, and you gotta you gotta test the parameters of the new whip, bro. You don't know. Okay, say I got two miles still empty. Do you really got two miles, <laughs> or do you got like 15 miles? I don't know. So literally two miles till empty, we, 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 we cutting it hella close, like hella, hella close. But you know, that's how I like to live my life, man. I live on the edge, man. We're gonna hit, it's gonna hit zero before we get it's to a gas It's definitely station. gonna hit zero before we get to a gas station. Now, I reduced my speed down to 67 miles per hour to conserve fuel. <clears throat> and then hopefully this electric part kicks in. This is what the, this is where the electric should really come in, like, you run out of gas, it should run on the electricity for the next at least half hour, hour to get you where you need to go. That's the whole point of having the hybrid. I mean, that's how I feel, man. Y'all let me know y'all thoughts. <laughs> we hope. Hopefully we just make it to the damn gas station right about now. Because now it's saying one mile. They got loves. We got lucky again. Look at this, bro. Hey, this is about to be a good week, bro. Look, we got no gas, one mile to the exit. They got a loves, so that means I can get some more fruit. You can't make this up, bro. We winning right now. We finna get gas and fruit again for the second time today, for the second time on E. Damn, gas high as Al Qaeda coming through here. God dang. Hey, bro, this is the highest gas probably damn near in the country. I just left California, and we in. What was it like over there? Indiana, about like this. Nah, gas was hella high at home, I ain't gonna lie. I, I bought gas right before I returned my rental car at home in Sacramento at the airport right there outside the airport. It was 519 for the cheap stuff, or 87. 
519. Oh, what does it say? Oh, it say, it say, no, my, it say Here's refuel. Left, like Loves. Right about now, I love. We love pulling love. up. <laughs> I got gas. We got a little downhill now. You could just roll in there. Okay, you in got there. to. Throw it in neutral. We made it. Bro, sometimes I'll be feeling like like my butt just became part of the seat, bro. Golly, it hurt too. It's like you got to stretch it out. Golly. So you know you can you can go to zero now. We can definitely make it to zero. Now, now beyond zero... I can't vouch. I don't. I don't really want to try that. Nah. Damn, 375 right now. It's hella hot. See, here I go again. This new truck, you gotta hit the gas in here, and you gotta open a gas cap inside to try. I ain't used to that. I'm used to just walking back here, opening it up. But see, on this, on this platinum, since we didn't got fancy. You gotta hit the button and all of that. So nobody can steal your gas. Yeah, so you can't get siphoned. Yeah. See, I had the old school SR5. You know, my other truck, we was kind of, it was low grade. Now we got platinum leather interior. You got a special button for the gas cap. You know, we're moving up, man. So you, what'd you just leave the grocery store? Man, I just left the gas station. You know, I had a few police days. Oh, hey, and you had, you had to drop some death off in that bad boy, too. Hey, yeah, it's either death or rolling coal. You <laughs> can't be rolling coal nowadays, you know what I'm saying? You gotta have that death, baby, that D-E-F. I'm, I'm, I'm two and a half I'm hours out. I'm in, I'm in Lansing. Oh, Lansing. Yeah, I saw that. So, Lansing, that was like, uh, I'm probably like, mm, let's see, I'm gonna tell you right now. I'm 88 miles from Lansing. So I'm like an hour and a half from Lansing, which is Lansing is only gonna be an hour away from Saginaw or Bay City. There's no way I'm gonna survive, bro. I gotta turn that, that AC gotta be chilled. He gotta he gotta be tamed. Oh my bro. Oh. Oh, it's on 60. <laughs> I told you, bro. I can't do it. <laughs> hey bro, you know. I wouldn't I, even do you like that. I bro. know you hey bro. Okay. <laughs> I ain't got words for that. Hella cold in here. <laughs> hey, how do how do beats go? Want? Hey, let us what in the DC, let me go. Oh, I thought you was in there. No. Hey, daddy. I was gonna say, let me go. Hey, 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 a poo poo. Hey, hey you my guy. You got you a big, a big water. Yeah, I got me a big dummy. Hey, look, but the good thing is it's a uh, natural spring water. Oh, hey, got his electrolytes in there. All right, no. No, 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 no. No? No, no, no. There's a difference between man-made put in there electrolytes Talk and electrolytes it. through the rocks. Okay, so, hey, well, hey, well, before you even learn, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> hey, 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 look, they, they, it's, it's totally different. So when y'all see elect, no, no, when y'all see uh, minerals added for taste. Okay. That's man-made minerals. Okay, okay. That comes out of a, 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 a laboratory. A laboratory. Yes. Like a chemist made that. Oh. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right. What about this here? Well, this right here, this natural spring water, this comes through the rocks <laughs> and the earth, and it catches sediment <laughs> and minerals and low-key. Hey, that's the electrolytes minerals. that you need for your body. Hey, we laughing? But that's, but that's facts. <laughs> hey, that's real talk. That's hey, I'm fact. proud of my boy. Hey, look, look, look. I'm proud of my boy. Proudly sourced from, they got a bunch of little sources. They all in Pennsylvania. So you telling me this ice mountain came from the mountains of Pennsylvania yeah. in the United States 
it went through some rocks and it came out and they put a bottle on it. They top and they capped it. Bob, they called him out the Appalachians. 100%. They put a Another cap on question. It. Fiji water. Hey, you know I like some Not Fuji. the Fuji. Not Fuji, but Fiji. Fiji. That, I, I drank one of them today, too. This is my third water. I drank a lot of water. I do. It says bottled at the source. Yeah. And it, it comes off of the island of Fiji. Do you think that's true? Like I don't they, know. I don't know where it comes from, for real. So you telling me they got a pipe. <laughs> that's just running water and they got people like filling up and they're like bottled at the sword baby <laughs> they put on an airplane <laughs> they send it to me no hey, bro, that is not they what they send hey, it to me guarantee you that is that's not what, what they, that's what it said that's on the back said. of the can that's why you bought it bottled at the source Hey, they, they, they cap it, From bro. the islands of Fiji. But, but keep in mind, all the water in this whole ecosystem is 70% of the earth. It goes to the sky and it comes back down. Okay. That, the what's, whole that, time. what's that called? What's that process? Precipitation, big dog. Boy, hey, take them to school. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look. Y'all ain't too. know y'all was going to geology hey, class. Here's what we're today. doing. But after it makes a cumulus uh, cloud, it gets it, it's cumulus. Yeah. It drops down. Yeah. And, but what if it has pollutants in it and it gets in my water? It's called acid rain, my boy. It's like you said. Acid rain. Yes. And then it's not purple rain. Hey, not Prince. <laughs> acid rain. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, look. We be wildin'. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Like this, mm -hmm. this is too long of a session, but like it's very much well needed. We got to talk. We got to talk it out. We got to talk. We got to talk. Hey, we got to talk about this. Somebody got to talk. Hey, we got to talk about it, bro. <laughs> Our, talk our travel video is gonna be fifty-two minutes. Facts. Us, right. us rambling about Come different water. water. It'll be a podcast. Hey, it's a podcast <laughs> about water Just and it. rain, acid rain at that. Boy, you took oh, me all the way boy. back to. Sophomore year in college, boy, yeah, the acid rain. What's the, the difference? What's the difference? What are we talking about? Cumulus. Tomorrow, <laughs> I'm gonna do my cloud study, and we're gonna look at clouds and tell y'all what it is. From now on, instead of coming out of these mountains, I'm gonna fall around cumulus clouds and just pick him up. Pick him up, baby. <laughs> mm. Oh boy. All right, we out. I think for tonight. For tonight. For tonight, we out, bro. All right, guys, so we all here. We didn't made it up here to Michigan. We just kicked back a few hours early, so we're going to slide around to a little little private lake, see if we can catch something. I don't know. We got we can only bring one rod, so it's hard to beat a finesse jig. Crack and crawl on the back. Can't really beat that. I'm going to swim him and drag him around and see what we can do. Should be fun. We finna, we finna slide out here, have a little challenge, me and the boys. Adrian already cast, and I don't like, I don't like how he's already out there and I ain't fishing yet. Cause we do got a little bit of challenge. Whoever don't catch one or catches the smallest, got to ride in the back of the camper on the way back. I ain't trying to have that be me. So I got to hurry up and get out here. I got to go. It, it was bouncing between four, uh -oh. three and four, five. Uh oh, oh my God. I caught nothing. Good. Oh. Don't, don't let him go yet. Four, four. Four, four. And a four, four. Is it a vegan? I don't know. Dude, they're all vegan. Oh. I got him off too. I'm gonna catch the biggest one. Four nine. Can we snap a single foot? For the fish or the scale? The fish. Of you. Four nine. Hey, I gotta wait mine just in case DC doesn't. Yeah, you don't or don't catch one or where's the scale at? Right here. Oh. Come on, dude. I'm about to get swimming out there. I gotta. That's a three pound. Well, take that camera off before you do, because I don't have that door on it. What we got? Jersey oh, boy. I don't know, I'm freaking oh, wet. Oh, got one. Oh! <laughs> Gosh. Oh. Oh, good, 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 good. That's the biggest Pink. one. That's the biggest one. It don't even matter. Put it back. <laughs> <laughs> That's the biggest one. Uh oh, no! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's a little one. Baby? Yeah. That's a five. Perfect. Baby boy. Hey, hey, Mark's riding in the back of his I'm brand on my new own truck. truck. <laughs> oh my god, he ate my trailer.
in my pocket, Adrian. I got another one in my pocket, trailer. <laughs> this is unbelievable. Dude, this place has got them, dude. <laughs> it does. This got big and stupid. Dude, they're all quality. I mean, look at them. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's another four pounder. <laughs> 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 Y'all could trailer this week? Oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah trailer right, right over here. here. Oh, you can catch a 22, 24 pound bag. Hey, did you let yours go? No, no. it's right here. Oh, oh my God. God. Oh, he got off. Oh my God. That was a big one. Hey, thank you. How big that? Don't, don't let him know. Not that big. Hey, I am not sitting in the back seat, please. I got shoddy. Get him sit in, so you and him can hold it out for the thumbnail. What do you think? What do you think? What's your Five. guess? Five even. Five three. Five pounds three ounces. Oh, I got him by an ounce. Did you? Did you? Hey, that's did you? Like the same fish. See if there ain't a hook mark in it. Dude, dude, look at that bloody tail, bro. Look, see huh. if there ain't a hook mark in it. No, you, you would have noticed no, that tail. No, both y'all for the thumbnail. Oh, hold it, hold them two up. Hey, DC, get in here real quick. Two five pounders. <laughs> That's a big one right there. Got the mic. Oh my God. Oh my e. God. <laughs> That's a damn big. A big Look at that big old black spot on it. Oh, oh, I said, damn, good. That's a five pounder. <laughs> That's a five pounder. Oh, <laughs> oh he got all oh, type of black all marks. Oh, he's bad, dude. Check him out. Dude, that's awesome. Are you going to wait here? Crack and crawl action. Yes, sir. You got lucky. Hey, you, hey that's what yeah, it's all about. Oh, let me zero him out. All right. All right, here we go. He zeroed? Thank. Hold that real quick, right? I, mean, I can work with that. Y'all got five pounds. I'm going to be sitting in the back again. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 Mark. Hey, Mark, hold him out real quick. Hold him out. What's your biggest? He's zero. Okay. I'm four something. Hold on. You got, you got. Oh, oh, no, no, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> God. I got him. I got his ass. He thought he was getting away. I got him. I got him. He's talking about the football. I got him. Oh, my God. Hey. I got him behind you and grab him. I'm like, where did you go? You cannot get away, bro. I got him. Go on the rod. Hey, I God. threw my damn rod and everything. <laughs> Hook, hook. He's, four, he's four nine. All right, big dog. Now you can go. <laughs> Yo, that's insane. <laughs> Is it a good one? Nah. Nah. I mean, he get a little. Two. All right. <laughs> God, look. Yeah, you Chose, don't even see baby. that jig, boy. Keep going, baby. Hey. All right. We're wrapping this up. This is the uh, travel vlog. It's a wrap. Hey, y'all stay tuned. We'll be back. We're going to have some dope vids coming from this right here.